Thank you for watching Grampy's videos. Hello and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Minecraft with Grumpy Grampy, Jason E. Johnson 3 1 on YouTube and Twitter, and we are continuing. Why would you breed llamas? It just said use hay bales to breed llamas, but why would you really need llamas? I don't know. I don't understand. We are continuing to build the what we're calling creeper poop farm. And if you didn't watch the last episode, um, creeper poop, I, I just, it, I was just thinking that we have visual glitches in the map here. Um, it looks like creeper poop instead of calling it uh, another name, um, the real name in the game. Um, because if I say that on YouTube, use the word G-U-N, uh, there's a possibility of being demonetized, so I don't want to say that. So we're going to call it um, Powder, or we're calling this a Creeper Farm instead of that kind of farm. And yes, I know that sounds kind of crazy, but that's how life is. I don't have control over what YouTube does, so we have to um, go by their rules. So let's put that there. Oh, that'll go out that way. That's good. All right, that one works there. That's just fine. Uh, let's put that one there. Oh, right there. See? That's what it's called in-game. But we're not going to call it that on the YouTube video because I don't want to get in trouble. So we are going to um, call it Creeper Poop. Because see, it looks like a little pile of poop. Look. Little poop. So when, so when the creepers die, they poop out a little bit of that. Boop. And that's what we're calling it from now on. Creeper Poop. From now on, it's called Creeper Poop. Uh, we don't need a obsidian birch log. I think I do need this adventure chest put out. Because I need that. Oh no, I don't need that. I don't need that yet. I need I need um trap doors, but I think my trap doors are somewhere. Uh, I wonder can I put that there and then those still open look at that you can that is amazing okay i was gonna say but i don't want to do that i want to put that um i'm just gonna put these along the side of here but you can do the trap doors on the side that's cool so we are continuing the trap doors uh we're building um the model uh, uh, really i'm modeling this after um a couple of different farms that other people have built. You just want to make sure that you're putting your trap doors because this is where I got messed up because I followed a YouTube video that was wrong. And in doing some testing and then do it, uh, checking this out again, really? And in checking this out, I realized that it was wrong. So we went back and reconfigured it. So I've got to put, um, what you have to do is you have to build... Well, on this one in particular, we're building six layers. So let me come down here. We're building six layers. Whoa, almost fell off. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. We may go up a little bit. I'm thinking I might go up one more. But um, the way I saw this one built on the YouTube video, they had... Um, they did some crazy thing up here at the top where they did um, where, uh, above each one. And they were going above the buttons, which didn't make sense to me. Because you have to go above each blank space here. So what they were doing is this right here. They were going up. They were doing this right here for every one of these. They were doing this. And they... Well, not that. They were going up three. And then they were, they were removing that. And then they were putting that there. And then they were removing that. And then they were opening the trap door. Or no, they, they weren't opening the trap door. They were leaving the trap door there. And then they were covering it with light above it. And I'm like, why would you do that? Um, why wouldn't you just go ahead and cover this with half slabs? And then put a roof over that? Because then you can expand it at some point. Um, um, or just go ahead and cover it. Just go ahead and cover it and then light it up on top. Um, co cover it with regular... Um, don't open the trap doors. Don't put the holes in. And then if you wanted to build it bigger at some point, just come and punch the holes in and put more trap doors in and make it go up a few more layers. Um, I, I think I 
think I've got enough trap doors to maybe go up another level. So I'm going to do seven levels on it. Let's just... Um, I think I'm going to go seven levels, but I'm not going to do that. Instead of that, I'm just going to build another layer. And I'm just building another layer. I'm not, I'm not doing what they did. But I've got to go back down here first and um, put these other trap doors on. So these trap doors are all on here. Let me do these trap doors here. And I'm going to start from this side over here because it's easier. And um, if you notice, I left my trap doors open. I had all the other ones open. Uh, or I've, I've got them closed. The, or these are closed. Because it's just easier to walk through. And I, I kept falling down the rabbit hole. I kept falling in the hole there. And so we're just going to... And it's a lot easier and faster. When I say easier, I mean faster. Less effort. To put these boogers on. Here like this. And um, as you see me doing this, I don't do tutorials. There's so many other videos out on the out on the internet. YouTube and so forth. Uh, there's some really good YouTube tutorial people out there. Um, I, I don't really mention names. I've, there's there's a few of them that I watch their videos and they're really good at tutorials. They 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 do a really awesome job and I couldn't compete with it. I mean, they're, they're, I don't one, I don't have the audience um, to make it worth my time to try to compete um, as far as views and all and I just wouldn't do it. I mean, if I can't do as a quality of job as they can that I'm not going to I'm not going to try because if I'm going to do it I'm going to try to do a quality job so that you give someone good instruction because that's the same you know philosophy when I'm teaching a classroom you want to have good instruction because if students are there you know you don't want it to be a waste of time so I don't try to uh, recreate videos and recreate that when somebody else has already done it so we're going to go slow right here because I'm walking on the edge, walking on the edge. And so now we have all of our open spaces, all of our open spaces have trap doors on them and all of our buttons right here. See, buttons are open spaces um, or buttons. Buttons have air gap here. Buttons have air gap so the spiders can't spawn. See, they, spiders need two. Spiders need two. And then the air gaps have, uh, the, the floor then has, um, the floor, bleh, can't even talk, the floor has, um, the open floor ones have slat, or have uh, trap doors above them. So I'm trying to decide what I do here. We've got seven layers here. What have I got? So what did I say I have? I've got uh, seven layers. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we've got six platforms. This should give us a good start. So I'm just going to come back through and let me check each. I'm just I'm doing a quality control check here real quick. Let me not swim. Let's uh let's do a quick quality control check. So all of this all of the trap doors are on the north side. All of the buttons are in place and as far as I can tell here I've got trap doors on all of the open air. I don't I'm not missing any. Okay, just did a quick... Okay, so floor one is good. And that's my phone, but it's not for me. Okay, we're going to check all of these, and all of the trap doors are open. And the other thing, I'll, I'll do a visual look down each hole here in a minute to make sure everything's good. But all of these, I'm checking all the floors here. All the trap doors are facing the same way. All of the ceiling panels. Okay, visual there. Floor three. Quick look here. Everything looks visually good. Everything is set. All right, we'll come back over here. Let me uh, do this here. Oh, I lost that one. Oh, that one went on down. All right, well, that's just one of them that I lost. I'm not going for it. So these are all open and set. So each row here, okay. And then we set and look for all of our panels, okay. Okay, these I have to open up. So let's check all of our ceiling panels first. All right, those are all good. And now let's go open all of these. We'll just walk around here. We just walk and make up, make sure they're opening up on the north side. 
Boop, 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 boop. That way it quits trying to eat. Because it kept trying to eat every time I'm opening up and I'm like, it keeps, it keeps like, like it's like, oh, I don't know, I'm going to eat. Nope, I'm not eating. I'm opening the door. Uh, all right. So we've got all those. I did all the visual check up there. We're all visually checked here. Let's go up to this level. We've got all of the doors, but I'm not going to open these yet. Let's go ahead and go up. One, two, three. Pull that out. And then let's... I'm going to go ahead and... um, What I'm doing here... I don't know what I did with... Uh, I stuck it in one of these boxes. Maybe I stuck it in this box right here. Uh, no, where did I leave it? Did I leave it downstairs? I've got a stone cutter, but I don't know what I did with it. Okay, well, I've got another stone cutter right here. I'm just going to put this one right here. And we are going to make some slabs. So on these, um, I'm going to go ahead because I'm prepping in just in case I go ahead and increase the size of this. I'm going to go ahead and build regular, regular blocks. I'm going to put regular blocks here. So this was, if I wanted to expand this upwards later on, I may not, I probably won't, but if I wanted to and make a bigger, I could do it. But in the meantime, uh-oh, let's uh, see where we've got some more. I may have to fly back to base. I thought I had some more here, but I do. Oh, that's... Really? Second time, right in a row. Alright. My phone wanted to... Google thought I was asking it something. No, I was not. I was not. And we're just going to go ahead and create the same pattern here. But we're going to... Um, do something a little bit different. We're going to go ahead and create the opening. Uh, am I out of scaffolding? No way. Really? I thought, oh, no, I was going to say, I had more scaffolding than that. I thought I made a whole bunch because I knew this was going to be a really tall build. So I went ahead and, so we're going to go ahead. I knew I had plenty. We're going to go ahead and you can kind of see this process here. Uh, you're just creating, no, not that. You're just creating uh, air gaps here. Really, the lag is crazy for some, I think it's the rain. I think the rain is causing some lagginess. Look at that. I mentioned the rain, I said, I think it's the rain. Look at the fog. Okay. Look how it slowly brightens up. This game is amazing. This 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 game is amazing. Look at the water color. Look at the water changes depending on deep ocean versus ocean versus blue. Look at the blue the blue lagoon and the green. And I'm not going to. Um, they won't spawn. They will not spawn on air gaps here. But they. Um, so they're not going to spawn an air gap. So this is going to be, um, this will be my um, um, top layer here. But I'm trying to decide here what I'm going to do. My stone cutter's in my inventory. It's right there. I'm looking for it, and it's right there in my inventory. Ah, oh, what a beanhead. All right. Okay, it was right there. Uh, let me see if I've got enough stone, though, because I don't know if I'm going to make the slabs. I may not have enough stone to do slabs for the top up there. I don't. Um, if I do slabs, I'm going to end up with 26, and that's not going to be enough, so I'm going to have to fly home and get some stone. I thought I brought enough with me. I did not. I've got a shulker box with me to be able to load that up. Um, what I'm going to do is go ahead and uh, these have buttons. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put down, I don't know if that's going to be enough, but I'm going to go ahead and put down the trap doors here. So 
you see I'm putting these down where there's air gaps. So it makes it less than, just slightly less than two, so that um, skeletons, ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Skeletons and zombies, zombies, zombies cannot um, spawn under there. Only creepers can, based on the mechanics of the game. We're using the mechanics of the game to problem solve. How do we get massive, multiple amounts of... of uh, oh, I have plenty of trapdoors. I've gotten... Or no, oh, can't say that. Creeper poop. How do we get creeper poop? Can't, can't say that word. Uh, we're got, we got to say creeper poop. Um, so how do we get lots of creeper poop? Um, we get lots of creeper poop by creating, um, taking advantage of the physics of the game. And that's what we're doing. We're using the, uh, just like you do in real life, really. You, you, uh, it's life hacks. You know, how do you get things in life? Um, how do you, how do you make an engine run in real life? Well, you, you make an engine run by taking gasoline or taking a flammable product, gasoline, diesel, petroleum product, and igniting it on fire. And then the resulting explosion, you use the energy from that uh, engine. So you explode something. So essentially when you're driving in a car or you're riding in a car, you have explosions happening and you're taking advantage of the physics of the... You're taking advantage of physics, chemical process, the chemical process of taking a petroleum product or something that's flammable, igniting it on fire, and the resulting explosion using that uh, energy. Okay, stop talking and focus on putting trap doors down. <laughs> Hey, let's try this one more time. How about let's try this one more time? Yeah, we're going to try this one more time. Did I run out of trap doors again? You've got to be kidding me. Okay, Maurice. I did. I put those in here. Blue box. Okay. Button, air gap, air gap. Boom, ba -ba boom, boom, boom. Okay. And boom. All right, so we've got our ceiling here is good. Um, I'm going to go ahead and open up these and do a check on the floors. I'm not going to put trap doors above me. And instead of using, I'm not going to fly back to base as I've been sitting here having a conversation in my head with myself. Uh, or going through the thinking process. I've been problem solving. So do I fly back and get stone? Or do I put some other kind of slab up here? Now I can put, um, I don't want to put buttons because that that would of course keep uh, spiders, but I could just buttonize this whole thing. Or I could do something a little bit different and I could come down here. I could, I could, let me try something here. Do I get moved? You, when you stand on top of them, it moves you. It, it's not moving me. I'm going to put this back here. I'm going to put this back in this box here. I am going to hold on to this birch log because I've got an idea here. Uh, at some point, and this is the problem solving process I'm going through in my mind. At some point, I may want to expand this one or two more levels just to increase production or increase um, how many um, creepers are falling down and dropping me some creeper poop. So if I look down each one of these holes, and that's what I'm just double checking here. We're doing a visual check here. All of the trap doors should all... Well, that's what the creepers are going to do. The creepers think, uh, from a physics standpoint, of the game standpoint, the creepers see the trap doors as a solid block. If you, if you don't know that, that's what's happening. So I'm not going to spawn any up here. But as we look down through here, I just want to make sure that the trap doors are all on the same side because... When they go here, when they fall through, I don't want them... Like, if I had a trap door here and then a trap door there, it could fall on that trap door and stop. But if they drop, walk off that, they are far enough out, they'll fall all the way down. 
I won't demonstrate it to you, but you can you can check it on your your game. Uh, I'm just doing a visual check here real quick to make sure without falling. Okay, everything's good there. Good there. Good there. Good there. Good there. That looks kind of like one of those mirror things when you when you reproduce something over and over. That's what that looks like, right? Isn't that cool looking? Wow, that visual effect, like the like the double mirrors or a mirror into a mirror. That's what that actually almost looks like. So we're just double checking all of the trap doors. I think I'm pretty good. Well, that's what the that's what we want the creepers to do. Um, I'm I'm you know what at this point, I'm pretty positive that I'll do I'll do a I'll do another quality control inspection check after uh, I stop recording. Um, right now I want to um, show you what I'm gonna do up here is if I want to expand this later if I just put half if I put slabs down that are stone. I won't be able to see which ones, you know, when I start digging, if I tear it up again, I won't be able to see. So I thought about this and I was like, you know what? I'm going to um, do this right here. I'm going to um, use wood slabs because if I use wood slabs, I can see them. See, I can use wood slabs. Let me just make a whole bunch of wood slabs here. And if I just do wood slabs up here, Nothing will spawn on wood slabs, and I'm going to go ahead, and I'm not worried about wood getting struck by lightning, because I'm going to put a cover over this anyway to block off the sunlight, or, uh, uh that's, wasn't good, that's the only problem about using slabs, and I'll leave the air gap for now, um, actually, i since I have the trap doors, I'm going to go ahead and put the trap doors on, but I'm going to enclose them for light purposes, uh, I'm not going to have enough slabs, I don't think. Oh, no, I might. I might have enough slabs. I'm just going to go ahead and put that there for now. We'll just slab all this. Oh, I mean, you can just listen to the music for a second. Those should... I'll go grab that one in a second. But those, those if they do not hit a trap door, they should hit the water. Uh, one of them, they might have a chance of hitting the ladder. They might have a chance of hitting the ladder and uh, not falling in, but most of them are going to get collected downstairs. So let's, uh, I'm not going to make a whole bunch yet because I don't want to overdo it. And I didn't go through and count, so. more though than that so how many more well, I just bum, 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 6 12 18 let's do 24 here I don't know if 24 is going to be enough but when I get down to the last few I will do a count real quick um, I may uh, I need 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so I have to make 12 I'll be a couple over, but that's all right. I'll save them. I, I've got a bunch of these back at the base, back over there. But um, at some point, I'll um, use them. Okay, we're done with that. We're done with that. We're done with that. We're done with that. Now, I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, uh, where'd my trappy doors go? Trap, trap doors. There we go. I'm going to go ahead. I don't need 64 of them, but... Oh. Well, that's a good thing about going ahead and having the water there. I've not fallen off the side of that yet, but I've fallen. I have fallen down a couple of times, but that's why I'm leaving my. That's why I still have my uh, wings on. So I'm gonna go ahead and put trap doors here, on the same side. See, but I'm not gonna open these up. These are going to be remain closed for light purposes. I don't think trap doors let light through. And then for the final, oop, did I get that too high? That's a spam call. I think I got that one too high. Yeah, that one got too high. Okay, that was uh. I hope that doesn't. I hope that doesn't get me a copyright. I hope that didn't. Sh I hope. I'm hoping that sound. I have the Star Wars Cantina on my phone. I need to mute my phone. Um. 
put it as a play again because I don't want to get a copyright strike for having the cantina music on there. Isn't it crazy how careful you have to be uh, when you're creating content? Uh, I, you know, it's just it's it's insane. Which I get it. I mean, it's their property. I mean, it's their intellectual property, and they should be able to sell it if they want to or whatever they want to do with it. But at the same time, it's just man. All right, I'm going to... Oh, buttons. I was going to put the buttons in there. I was going to put my stone cutter back there. Put my ladders up. Put those up. I can hold on to my wood, but I'm going to put it there for now. All right. Um, now, I know I could test this at this point. It's nighttime. I've got plenty of time. So we could... In fact, I'm going to go ahead and, oh, oh, it's not what I wanted to do. I'm going to do this right here. I meant to do this. This is what I wanted to do. Come here. Okay, I got all my chests back. Did I get all my chests back? I've got my two shulker boxes. I've got my building box, my yellow box, my blue box, and my white box, my adventure box. Okay. So I'm going to leave the scaffolding here. Because I don't think any of them can spawn on the scaffolding. But we're going to do a test on this. Let's, um... It said on the reading that I needed to change my simulated chunks to four. But it's okay. Uh, we should be able to uh, go out 38 and test this. So let's, uh, so how many levels do I have here? We have one, two, three, four, five, six spawning platforms. So if we have six, let's go on this one right here. And I'm going to go on the north side. I'm going to go on the side of my here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, let's, so that's uh, one, two, three, four. We're going to come right here. So let's go out one. Um, how far do we have to be out again? I can't remember how far we have to be out, but I'm gonna, gonna take, that way they can't come after me. I don't want them coming out here, but we're just gonna build out about 24. I think it's 24, if I remember reading correctly. And I'm not gonna put any light on these, because I don't think any will spawn here, but if they do, I'll just take off real quick. I do not have any gunpowder in the chest. Oh, I just said it again. I don't have any creeper poop in the chest downstairs. But I'll have to find out where the optimum spot is. But let's see if they're going to. Now, I was told that... Oh, there, oh there's one. There he goes. It's working. We got one. We got one. Light's coming out. Yahoo! Okay, it's working. So we've got one. I'm just not seeing any more. So we will have to change my simulation chunk down to four. Because by doing that, I would eliminate anything spawning way down there altogether. That's one of the nice things about Bedrock. I may still be too close. Maybe. Or the light level. This new light level might be messing up, but that's okay. So at least we saw one spawn, so we do know. I'll, I'll take all this up later in the day. <laughs> Elite your wings for the win. <laughs> Elite your wings for the win. Uh, so now the next step will be to put a roof on. Uh, we're about 30 minutes into this video. Um... So we are going to, I'm going to remove this uh, temporary platform here. And then uh, let's, uh, before I do that, I'm just going to go ahead and drop down and see. Uh, I still had my ladder here. So I'm going to go ahead and remove my ladder. All together. We're just going to remove that. And then we're going to check to see how much, did, did I get any creeper poop? Did we get any creeper poop out of that? I don't know. Uh, we're here at the bottom. Did we get any? Success! We got two. We got two on our initial run. Okay, our our test run. Uh, and if you remember my problem solving, 
when I talked about the problem solving, um, the problem solving is you got to plan, do, check, act. So we planned everything out. Um, we did it. Now we checked it. We are getting creepers spawning. We are getting them dropping. And uh, now we're going to act upon that and keep working. And we're going to see from now. Oop, I'm going to put that right there. There used to be a time when the uh, when these torches would spawn in the corner of this little X right there, or this little box there, and it was it was irritating that it would do that. Um, just kind of irritating. Now, so now what I was what I'm going to do is just out from the well from down there, I'm going to build the big tower. I've just got to I'm going to build it to this size platform here because this is the platform. I'll encase this here so you can be in here in nice and nice and tight. This should be enough to spawn if you're here to keep spawning. And I'm going to create a, a, a perch way up top up here. So we're going to come up here and we're going to create um, probably in the center spot. I'll probably find a spot right in the center somewhere. Um, or maybe on the side here because I want to make sure I'm within good radius of all platforms. But um, I'm going to come up uh, however many I need to be from this platform level right here. So I will do some calculations and I'll figure out. So from this platform, level, 162. So from 162, I'll build up and that's going to be the top of my tower. And I'll make the observatory at the very top. And it will cover this, and I'm gonna cover. I'm gonna come up from there with glass. So I've got a poop load. I mean, a poop load of sand. I'm gonna have to go find and smelt because I've got some glass, but I don't have near enough. And I'm thinking I'm gonna have to um, go squid hunting if I'm gonna do this in black or cactus farming if I'm gonna do it in green. I think I want green just to keep it in the creeper theme. Um, you won't really see the glass from. Um, from the outside of the tower, but I'm thinking I may leave it. I think I may incorporate the glass as part of the tower coming up, and so you can see it from outside. I'm just hoping they don't change the um, physics of the game at any point and say that glass, because I, from my understanding, glass does allow light through. Colored glass does not. So we will uh, we'll see. I'm gonna take all this out here. And then I'll end the episode on my platform right here. Boop, boop, boop. And, uh, whoa. whoa. We'll, uh, we'll end the episode right here. Appreciate everybody watching. Thank you for all of your support. We'll give you a wave there with my axe. Uh, okay. So, hope everybody has a great day. Remember, uh, be careful out there. It's a, it's a crazy world. I know, oh, I never, I never expanded my windows. Sorry about that. Um, hope you have a, um, uh, happy holidays. Uh, these are coming out during the holidays. So whatever holiday you celebrate, if you don't celebrate a holiday, my, um, you know, hope, hope life is treating you well. Uh, and just remember to be excellent to each other. Thank you for watching Grampy's videos.